The Death First Heard case came and went. It's long over. Aquaman 2 also came and went. It didn't do so well. It tanked, it flopped, whatever you want to say. But on social media, especially X, there's still fan skirmishes going on and things like that. And also you see a little more push these days for positivity on you-know-who. So this person here who's a pretty big Amber fan, we probably all know, says, Who Trolled Amber is set to release on February 27th. I stand with AH. Tortoise Media to launch investigative podcast on the Johnny Depp vs. Amber Heard trial. So, this media source who I checked out, they've got an okay-sized website. They're in the UK. I'm not sure exactly how big they are. Are going to release this thing here. It's called Who Trolled Amber? The title assuming someone did, which is what I don't like. So, they claim they're not biased, but their title implies this negative thing happened to her. Not something nonpartisan. But that's just my silly opinion. I'm sure they'll play it fair. Of course, it's got people talking. Like I said, fan skirmish is still going on. Why Amber spent so many money for buy the media instead of give the money she promised to charity? Probably English is a second language there, but I get the point. You can't spell ghost without goth says, I'll tell you who told Amber, her parents, because they never told her no. Coco says, H always passes the buck. Whenever she makes a mistake, she says someone else did it. H still ignored that she had no having proof, no having gone to criminal court or being found guilty. No, just allegations should be enough to completely ruin someone she did it. And Fred Worst says, get a job, Amber. I guess Fred is the worst. Just going by the name there. Just kidding. All right. Fred's probably all right. Ozzy Mountain Girl says, just more trash that will be full of lies. I won't argue. Apple Sugar Wagger says, we will be sure to watch Johnny Depp film that day. And says, we don't care, we watch the trial. So as you can see, lots of Johnny support here. And I gotta say in seriousness, this person here is a big Amber fan. And I gotta thank them for leaving the comments on. Because Eve Barlow, Amber herself, and a lot of other Amber fans don't leave the comments on. So I'm honestly saying, alright, good for you for at least hearing it out. I sense biased. Red Leader says, hell, I'll be there. Maybe a Star Wars fan... And if so, probably a Disney Star Wars fan if you still, you know, flaunting that now, but maybe, maybe not. I hope not a Disney Star Wars fan. And Andrew McGee says, A.H. brought her global humiliation onto herself. Johnny warned her, but Heard refused to listen. She thought her lies would be believed without question. She was wrong. Can't argue with that either. And Sean quotes what they say. Series will look at social media's impact and manipulation during trial. So yet again, ignoring evidence and facts in favor of a biased narrative. Sato says, let me guess, it's social media's fault she lost, not the evidence presented in court. Well, yeah, that's the thing. I mean, if the title's Who Trolled Amber Heard, then how much of Johnny's side are they going to take? From a surface level, doesn't seem like much. And Dr. Saruman the White says, I can answer for you right now, Amber trolled herself. And I wouldn't doubt a former white wizard. I think he's gray now or something, but you know, he knows some magic. And as you can see, comments keep going. IR also says she trolled herself. Sherry says, who cares? I thought she wanted to move on. Depp did. But you all won't let this go. We survivors of abuse don't want to keep bringing our abuse up. Why does she? We want to heal, but she's nothing without Depp. So that's why. Interesting point. Interesting point, Sherry. I'm not a victim of abuse, so I can't say firsthand, but it makes sense. Anyway, quick little video here that's basically the news. As you might know, Vice TV is also releasing something with Amber's former lawyer, Elaine Brennerhoff, Brennerhoff, Brerhoff, however you say it, that's going to be bigger than this, I'm going to assume. Obviously, that's also about blaming social media. So that's their angle. I guess it's Elon Musk's fault and Mark Zuckerberg. But probably these commenters were right. It's her own fault. Anyway, let me know what you think in the comments. Doing shout outs, special thanks, pop culture, whatever comes up. If you're not subscribed here, consider it. If you don't, I'll be sad, but I'll get over it. See you next time. All right, I'll make this quick. I'm rebooting my patron. I've got a tier now where you could get a gift from Japan. You got to send me an address, of course, and that'll be monthly. Maybe check it out. The link's down below. Also, there's a thanks button there if you want to donate a little bit to the channel, but to any YouTube channel who's monetized, not just me, it's got a little sidebar there. And lastly, I've got a PayPal if you don't like using credit cards or stuff like that. That's also linked below. That's about it. Just an option if you feel like donating. If you don't, that's cool too.
I do a video a day or more, so you'll see one pretty soon on the channel.